What's up everybody? Sparrow with a gun here from Sleepless Nights with another episode on Space Engineers working on the space station. Uh, when we left off we had made this kind of like T-junction here, um, which will... You know, now that, I'm, now that I'm looking at this, this might not... This might not work that well. Let's actually get rid of this. And the reasoning is that will keep us in this 3x3 three three pattern uh, for walkways and things of that nature. Um, so in this episode, one of the things that I wanted to do is attempt, I don't know if it'll work or not, but I'm going to try, at least for, as a temporary measure, to make um, beacons. As I mentioned in the last episode, that will, <coughs> excuse me, they'll basically set up a perimeter so that I know where everything is in terms, uh, in terms of like, this is the wall for, the, if you go any further than this, the asteroid will, you know, be gone. If you go further that way, that's the edge of the asteroid, further down, and so on. So. Let's grab... Where did they put the beacon? There they are. Okay, so let's grab beacons. Beacon. Okay. Now, what I may actually have to do... I don't know... I don't think I can just place... Beacons. No. So what I'll have to do is come over here and make like a new small ship. Oh, and power. They're gonna need power, too. Didn't think of that. So let's put, like, this... Which way is up for these things? I think they look the same. Alright, so there's a beacon. Right? Uh, let's actually put it... Can we put it under here? Please? Dang it. Um, Alright, then let's reselect our drill. Let's see if this works. Just take a little off the edge. A oh, little off the top. Oops. There we go. Alright, now... Can we not... I thought we could log in with these. No, I guess we cannot. Um, it's a small ship, so what we could do... is use a small container. Oops. Wrong button. Nope, wrong button again. Like, oh crap! Alright. We're gonna cut and paste. <laughs> oh, hey, that's an idea. I didn't even think of that. That we could just cut and paste where we wanted if I could see where I'm placing it and get myself out of the box. Alright, let's back up a little. Try that again. Because <laughs> I'm like in the box, so it's making it difficult for for me. Now, that's not going to let me access it either. Dad gummit. Why can I not access these things? I should be able to. Or is it the way that I placed this? Oh wait, there we go. Alright, beacon. Aha! I have one. Okay, so... Let's call this one top. Alright. And I'm just gonna see if I can get this a little bit closer. Alright, 
there is about as good as I'm going to get, I guess. Alright, so that's top. Let's go over here. And say... Well, the other thing is we should keep it level for now. So... Let's put one here. Like so. Are you seriously floating away? <sighs> Sometimes I really hate the physics in this. Okay, so that's pretty good. Pretty close. And we'll... I have to be right on that door, apparently. That's not annoying at all. And let's call this one. This should be right. There we go. Um, level with that, then. Or at about. Level with that-ish. Let's put one right here. I guess this is the furthest out it'll be. Come on, why can't I place? Stop floating away. There we go. And let's grab you. And this can be. Wait, what happened? Back. Okay. Oh, staying level with that. Around here. And at this level, it would seem this is actually the the left or whatever. And it doesn't have to be precise, it's more like guidelines than actual rules. <laughs> Okay. Let's make this one left. Now the last one we're going to do is the very bottom. And that way we can tell going down where the bottom of the asteroid is. Come on, stop flying away. I absolutely despise the physics in here. And and to be fair, whenever you hear me say that, which is often and loudly, um, it's not... Uh, I'm not like faulting the developers or anything like that. I'm just saying I personally would be okay with it being less simulator and more gamey, is all. Kind of like the difference between a Gran Turismo and Need for Speed. You know, like one's funner, one's more accurate. That kind of thing. Now, why doesn't this feel like the very bottom? Maybe it's because of my orientation. I'm like screwed up, not looking the right way. Um, what? Thank you. There we go. So this will help us with digging purposes to let us know where everything is, and we can always go back and delete them later, but that way, and I won't say that we'll never have any kind of... Actually, now that I'm looking at the shape of this asteroid, if we make like a ladder in the center type of thing, we can go straight down, but then we can also curve out and widen it. So this should be a lot of fun to work with, actually. I think, anyway. Um, Alright, so now let's do... Windows. Um, I know I had lights on 8. What was, oh, 7 was interior walls, if I can find them again. And drill is nine. Now, we might not get to the ladder thing yet, so I'm not going to be 
gonna worry about it. So where am I? All right, top's over there. So we don't. It's good that we put this wall here because if top's there, it slopes down. So we don't have too much room before we get over that way anyway. Um, left is 18. Wait a minute. If it's only 18 meters. That doesn't seem like I have very much room over there at all. Like, if this is 18 meters away, or roughly... I've got a little bit of room, I guess. But not much. That'll be that'd be something that would be cool. Is kind of the um, uh, Minecraft F3 button kind of deal. Okay, let's carve away a little here. Here's another way we can tell too. If let me let me analyze this real quick because I think my theory is correct. My theory is that there's no blue out here, right? This is all rock looking. So, another thing that we can basically use is the blue that's in here. This whatever cyan mineral this is. So as long as we've got this, we're not close to the surface yet. But when this becomes like this, when it turns into this silver rock stuff, uh, then we're then we're closer to the surface. So let's dig this out and see where we go. A little bit. We're also going to need to tear some of this out for walls if we're going to go that far over. Woo. Um, and we'll work on the, the ceiling part in a minute. I'm more trying to figure out how far out I can go. More than anything. Before this turns into the exterior of the asteroid. Do I have my lights on? There we go. That'll help me see a little bit better. <clears throat> so, one thing that I'm not really sure what to do on exactly is the, um, kind of what to do with the rooms, per se, because there's not a whole lot of functioning blocks in this at the moment. So, I'll need to come up with, like, I, I know one I want to be, like, a refinery room. One will be the med bay, and so we'll have that even though it doesn't work yet, we'll have the medical room type of thing. Um, actually, you know what? We'll just make this room that we're carving out possibly the medical room. Because that way, it's right when you walk in. You know, it'll kind of be... That's kind of where you'd need a medical thing, I would think. Um, unless we simply want to make this a entryway kind of area and then go down to multiple floors and then the floors are you know your your med bay and all that kind of stuff but that sounds like a lot of um a lot of work to be honest like i didn't really envision this being a huge sprawling project although the glitch ship went kind of long too i wasn't really planning on that either I mean, in, in being a long, drawn-out project, that was supposed to be a lot shorter than it ended up being. Um, so there's always that. Ugh, that stupid rock, really? If that's the only reason this won't place, I'm gonna be very mad. Oh, the camera. Okay. Let's just... Oh, I'm starting to hit rock, I think. Why is this one piece not changing? Go. Go away. Away you go. Um... Hello. Thank 
you. I keep wouldn't dig. Alright, is this changing colors yet? Not entirely. Yeah, this really kind of does give me flashbacks to... Oh, there we go. We don't want to go much further than this then. So do I have enough room to place one of these? Yes, if I can get rid of this. Well, actually, this should be the wall, so... Let's dig some of this out. Oops. My bad. Here, let's do like that. And... Like that. Get rid of you. That won't work. Okay. So this is going to be the edge of that then, as it won't go any further over from the looks of things. Um, oops, dang it. Oh, okay, I should probably fix that one too then. I didn't think about it actually denting it when I drilled the other one. My bad. want to go too much further in than that. That didn't really actually get us very far, to be honest. I mean, it's fine, but that really wasn't as far over as I would have hoped. So maybe that won't be the med bay. Um, actually, you know what? Let's just leave that. It's like it grew into the wall or something. Um, and what we can do... I don't think there's any, like, chairs or anything in this game yet. But what we'll do is make this kind of like a... Um, oh, here's another question I had. Can you paint these? No. Interior walls don't seem to be able to be painted. Okay. That's good to know. Um... Let's see, there's no real chairs or anything yet, but there isn't in Minecraft or anything either, but we make do. Um, so let's do something... Let's play around with pillars and see if we can't make like a lamp type of thing. Uh, we haven't really been using windows much yet. Let's see. see, okay. So we've got... Oh, that might not work the way I wanted it to. Oh, hey, that would be cool. It would look like it's holding it up now. I guess not. Fine. Um... So, what I'm thinking... see. I was thinking some kind of seating type thing, but all these blocks are too darn big. Um, so I guess that's not gonna work. We'll put... Oh, let's put some storage crates. That always will make it look like there's a point and purpose to things. Oh. Medium are not available for lar for stations. How at large? Oh, large are. Whew. Oh my. Oh my goodness gracious. That is the biggest box I've ever seen in my life. Okay. Um, so we'll put... A couple of crates like that, maybe. That kind of looks like it's got storage room, that kind of junk. Um, and then I want to put 
some kind of ladder, but I don't want it to be just in the middle of the floor. That would look kind of odd. So what we could do... What we could do is make a hallway in here. Oh, where'd my drill go? Let's make like a hallway thing through here. Um, it won't really be a hallway. What it is is it'll just be like a little um, door, doorway type thing. Mind me, I'm just digging away. Um, I really do like that they implemented this, though, that you can actually shape stuff. It's pretty awesome. That's surprising, to say the least. Actually, that's not supposed to be there. For what I have planned. Mwahaha. <laughs> Take this out more. One there, one there. Okay. And... Do I need any other ones? No, I don't think so. Okay, we need to put that there, so we need to get rid of this. Like so. Um, now for future, we'll also need to get rid of this section down here and place another one so that we can keep this tunnel going in the future. Come on. I'll be really happy when if they end up doing some kind of like demo charges. Um, although there are the warhead blocks, I'm afraid I'll blow up what I've already built here so far. So I don't want to use them. But yes, I have thought about them. I do know they exist. So um, right now that should work. Now, if I were to fly down here, if I can get out of the way, can I really not place that because I'm stuck in the... Oh my gosh, I hate getting stuck in this thing. <sighs> this is so annoying. I hate that I can't turn when I get stuck. That's the most irritating part. So we've got our little tunnel th like that going. Now what we can do is actually put this back. I didn't really need to break that, I, I guess. And then we'll do a door here, right? If we can get this stupid rock out of the way. So that'll be the airlock to like um, other floors. So you'll walk in, you know, Grab this, climb on up to observation deck, down to med bay, what have you. And then back up, seal the airlock, so on and so forth. This, I don't know, we might, might make that another storage area or something of that nature. Um, the last thing I think we're going to have time for in this one is to go through these last lights and get them properly set up again. Is that all I needed? I guess so. I can turn mine off now. There we go. Um, so yeah. It's coming along. I know that it's not the most creative or coolly designed or whatever, but I don't really know how to design a cool station. Like, a station is just a building, so it's not like... You know, I don't really... 
The other thing is being internal, like this isn't something that's seen from the outside, so that makes it difficult as well. I think the next episode, though, we're going to go up, and I have an idea for making an, uh, like an observation deck, which I think would be really cool. Um, so we're going to work on that in the next episode. So I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!